Oh, it's time to eat. Spring is nine days away. Is that that? It's just nine that days? Okay, but we're cooking up some spring goodness with celebrity chef Mark Bailey. He dressed up for us and Look he is him. ready to go. Look at there, shirtless Mark. I put on clothes. To <laughs> <laughs> his book, Cooking in Boxers, is filled with some of his yummy recipes. Yes, yes. and right now he's going to show us how to lighten up our pasta, which I'm very interested in hearing about. So, good morning. Thanks good for being morning. here. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Yes, it, you know, spring is coming. So it's time to kind of just eat a little bit lighter. Yeah. You want to spend less time in the kitchen, get away from the heavy meats, the chicken, and just stay to maybe vegetables and pasta and calamari and stuff like that that we're going to be hooking up today. Okay. Oh. So are these some of the more popular dishes that are that we're going to be seeing right now? Yeah, as well as you're probably going to see a lot of vegetables this season yeah. too with pasta. Definitely. Mm -hmm. um, people don't want to spend that much time in the kitchen realizing. Yeah. It now. So, so how yeah. do you spice up pasta? Well, you know, one of the good things to do is choose different pastas. You know, like for example, today we're going to do a, a chili, a red chili pasta, fettuccine, right? Infused pasta. We got penne, that uh, veggie with uh, carrots that and uh, tomatoes. So this is the penne the, with the vegetables. Yeah. Right? So the idea is to get pasta that doesn't is not just a plain white wheat, you know, flour. Right. Uh, 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 pasta. Give it a little flair. Yeah. Get some. There's so many different types of pastas out there. So All right. Let's cook it up. Let's go. Yes. Definitely. Okay. So what we got going right here is some onions and garlic, mm -hmm. sautéed a little butter. We're making a pan. Yes. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and we can just throw some stuff. It's like very much dumped. We got some oregano. Okay. So I'm gonna throw that in there. That's peppers. If you want to throw it. How in. many? Do I do all of it or throw it all in? Really? Yeah, okay. Wow. Yeah. Oh, the crew is so excited. They're yeah. like, yeah, they're going to get to so eat. So we're going to toss that all right. around. <laughs> exactly. And this is the spice agent, which is those little red pepper flakes. I love red pepper flakes. Yeah. Exactly. Between this and the pasta, which I already mentioned, yeah. is chili. So that's where you're going to get your... That just took a I, notch. It went out in my nose. Yeah. That, huh? exactly. And they're smelling that and weehawking. And then Woo! you can toss that um, calamari in there Okay, now. all of it? Yes, mm -hmm. which was previously sautéed for like about four to five minutes in some butter. Okay, but then you can just set it aside set and then exactly. put it back in. And then okay. put it back in. Just because you don't want to overcook calamari. It gets too mushy. Yeah, and it yeah. gets like, it gets, um, oh gosh, what is it? Like what was a it? Stringy. Yes. Yeah, exactly. rubbery, rubbery. Yeah, yeah. So you want to quickly sauté that and then we can add our pasta. Okay. Again. And this is red chili fettuccine. Yes. So this actually you got a little chili kick to it's it got too. A little kick to it too. Oh, you're gonna be you good. know all about spice. You know, I know. That's the Caribbean in you're, not, you're my kind of guy. <laughs> I you, love things that are where spicy. Where do you buy this stuff? You know, you all the markets have it now. It's so funny. You know, you can really find this stuff all at your 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 you know um. In your grocers, grocers. like in the freezer. Yeah, yeah. it's not yeah. just about the probably a couple anymore. down from. Well, Chef some Boyardee. of them are fresh. No, some some of these they make them fresh. They and make they them fresh. Them in like the refrigerated section, oh, yeah. so you can just find them and throw them. Exactly. Easy dinner. You don't you don't have to boil them that long. You know, it's really just quick three minutes. In. And then we just add a little black pepper, you okay. know, as if it wasn't spicy enough. Exactly. You gotta, you gotta add a little more. You're gonna have so, a cold for a yeah. month. And what I like to do is put a little of the um, the water from the pasta, okay. just to give it a little, you know, juice. Right. And it, you know, the starch also gives it some good flavor. Okay. What is and this about five minutes? Look at that. You Once see? you have you the calamari done, you just you're done. You're done. You're really done. You see how fast this that was? This is so easy. Easy, quick, and you guys are gonna dig in. Yeah. Okay. While well, you're serving that up, what are, what are the little treats did you have? Here. Yeah. We went over the vegetables. What's I this? did an angel hair pasta here with lamb. Like I said, I kind Do of serve this? lamb. Yeah, I shift from beef to lamb in the springtime. So that's ground lamb with uh, tomato wine sauce. Come on, angel. Mm -hmm. Over angel yeah, hair Joe, pasta. Yeah, come over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dig in. And then I also did a little pesto um, bow tie pasta there with walnut pesto. Okay. And Ooh, then, walnut I'm pesto. Oh, yeah, yeah. sorry. Okay, yeah. Here, but did you get any? I'm good. I'm thinking. Did you guys get? Did you guys get any calamari? You got some? Yeah, I did. Okay. Did. Yeah. All right. Are you heavy-handed with your pesto? Because I, I feel like you need to feel that. I like garlic. You want to let people really know I had pesto basil. this morning. Exactly. And then, yeah. like I said, I did walnuts on this one, so it kind of switches it up from the. Yeah, but the walnuts give it added nutritional benefit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. You get definitely. that omega three, mm -hmm. and yeah, it's really wow. good. The last one on the end is an anti-pasto, actually, pasta, and that just has anchovies, broccoli. You got. Some peppers in there as well. So, yeah, that's the one you're wow. about to dig in. Every is now it and then, so good. It, 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 yeah, you, it even it even is staying right here on your lip, John. I'm not cooking in boxers. I'm dancing in <laughs> well, So these are all lighter, so I'll look good semi nude. Yeah. Right? yeah, you know what? Exactly. It's all about just eating lighter, I guess, in the summertime as well as not spending that much time in the kitchen. You, you know, know what, Mark? I like that it's a variation. You know, I mean, you're always getting, you know, the pasta with the meat sauce, but it's always the same. Same. The same time. Exact, exactly. This is that a little bit different. Tomato wine, si wine, wine sauce is a Amazing. I mean, really? It, yeah, it, it Are these in your book? These recipes? No. To well, make my these? book is a breakfast cookbook, so this is all. But this is coming. This is coming. We need yeah. you to make it you a know, second installment. A little dinner. Yes, definitely. Absolutely. <laughs> Look at that. Cooking in boxers. Mama oh, must gosh. love that. Huh? <laughs> yeah.
Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, then we better leave up the graphic. Sorry, Mom. You know what? I'm sorry. You took off your shirt on the cookbook. Go ahead. Just take it off now. No, well, he has his microphone on, so he can't do that. I'll come back. He's probably wearing Spanx. That's Bailey. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for cooking. Also, the book Cooking with Boxers is already, it's coming out soon. And you can head over to our website to get all the